Hey, what's up, y'all? Coach Rock here, the official trainer for I Love Basketball TV. Today, I'm going to show you guys a few drills and concepts that you can use um, to shoot the basketball with more accuracy. So let's get into it. So when it comes to shooting the basketball accurately, there's one key component, and that is shooting the ball straight. So if you're missing the if you're missing left to right, then that means there are some flaws in your form that need to be fixed. If you're missing short and long, that means you were just off maybe with your depth perception or you, you overshot it, you undershot it. That's fine. It's like if you're on the rim, that's okay. But the problem is when you start missing left and right, then that means there's some things that you need to fix in your form, whether it's your elbow being out here, whether you're using your thumb too much um, when you shoot. So I'm going to show you a few drills that I like to use, like beginner and advanced drills that you can use to help perfect your form and make sure you're, you're shooting in a straight line. So the first thing we're going to get into and here, let me take you to this wall. And the cool thing about these drills is that you can do them on whether you're at home, anywhere. Just find a spot, whether it's on the wall, on the garage. Now you might not want to do this in your room or something. Your mom will probably come and spank you. But um, find a garage, find outside. You could use a pole outside or something. And you just want to find a spot to hit. So say I'm going to try to keep on this straight line right here. I'm gonna try to um, shoot and hit that straight line every time. So this makes sure I'm shooting the ball straight. Now if I have my elbow too far out here and I shoot, I might be off. Or if I'm thumbing the ball too much, then it might end up you know, over there. So this is a great way to go through your form. You could even do this one-handed and that'll make sure that you're shooting the ball straight. So that's one good drill. Another good drill to do is you could use a baseline. So if you don't have a wall, if you don't have, if there's nowhere in your house that you can hit, there's no pole you can use, um, then you could use find a spot on the ground. So here we're gonna use the baseline, this little red line right here, the line. And then you're just gonna, same thing, shoot the ball up and you're trying to hit that line. That, that lets you know that you're shooting the ball straight. So again, just go into your basic form. It's basically like form shooting. Just going straight into your form, and then you're shooting it in the air. Just trying your best to hit the line. Now this one will be a little more difficult because it's harder to judge where that line is at than when you're using the wall. But still, you understand the concept. Try to hit that line. All right, so now another drill we have. This is one of my favorite drills. You may have seen me um, go over this drill before. I love doing this drill, even just warming up on my jump shot, um, warming up with the players that I work with, with their jump shots, having them do this before games. It's a great way to make sure you're shooting the ball straight. So you're gonna use the side of the backboard. Now this is pretty challenging because if you're off, unlike the wall, the wall, if you use the wall and you're off, the ball's still gonna come back to you. On the side of the backboard, if you're off, the ball is gonna go far left or far right because of the angle that it hits the backboard. So you wanna make sure the ball is coming right back to you. So if you miss, it's gonna go like that. If I miss right, it's gonna go like that. Now if I hit it straight, it's gonna come right back to me. And that's how you know when you're shooting the ball straight. Like I said, this, this drill's a little more difficult um, because if, you, if you're off, then you'll really be able to tell you're off and you're, you're gonna to have to chase the ball. But add this drill to your training anytime, like before you work out, um, even after you work out before games and stuff, just to kind of go over through the form shooting and then go through um, shooting the ball straight. And then you could even do one hand, which is a lot more difficult, but it's still the same type of thing. So if I'm off right there, I'm off right. There we go. So straight, now I'm shooting straight. And it really just helps you get that, you know, find that. If you could hit that little square right there, that little rectangle area, then imagine when you're on to the basket, you have a lot bigger, you know, a lot bigger area to, to make or miss. So even if you don't hit that exact spot, you can still be off a little left, off a little right, and you're still gonna make it. So this really helps you um, work on shooting the basketball straight. All right, now the last one we're gonna get into, all this, as you can see, is basic form shooting. And that's the best way to master your form, master shooting the ball straight and shooting with more accuracy. You have to have a good um, form, good basic steps. I've done past videos on how to shoot a basketball, you know, the proper form. And like I said before, there's no one form that's Perfect, it's whatever feels comfortable, but just don't forget the basics. Don't forget having a good base that's balanced. Don't forget trying to keep your elbow um, in an L 
And don't forget shooting with this C right here. So you could check out my other video, how to shoot a basketball perfectly, and that's going to go more over the form. So here we're just doing accuracy. Now the last one we're going to get into is same thing that we've been doing before, except this time you're just using the basket. So then once you master two-hand shot like we've been doing, your regular shot, then we're gonna go right back into one hand, still make sure you're shooting that ball straight, holding that follow through, getting a good hand in the cookie jar, or they say goose neck, whatever you wanna use. Make sure you're getting that follow through high. And, that, and these techniques right here, these four drills that I quickly went over, they don't take long, but when you do them every single day, it builds muscle memory into your jump shot, and then when you start stepping out farther, it makes everything much easier, makes your shot much more accurate. So then that's gonna help you, and then you step out here, you step out farther, and you still practice shooting the ball straight. Same thing, holding that follow through, holding the ball, your um, hand in the cookie jar, And that's all it takes, just repetition, building that muscle memory, and getting, having confidence in your shot. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you want a free basketball training workout that's gonna help you take your scoring to the next level, click this button right here. That's gonna take you to a page. I'm just gonna ask you for your email. You give me your email, and I'll personally send you over a free basketball training workout instantly. Um, if you're on any mobile device, whether it's an iPad, iPod, your phone, whatever, you can still get that workout. Just click the first link in the description, freaktraining.com slash free workout. Follow those same steps, go to that page, give me your email, then I'm gonna send you that workout, check your email, and you can start training today to get better. As always, if you enjoyed the video, do me a favor, hit that thumbs up button for me, like it, comment below, let me know what else you wanna see, whether it's moves, um, player breakdowns, drills, Anything you need, you know I'm here, you know I got you. As always, subscribe to our channel, I Love Basketball TV. Um, you know I'm gonna keep them videos coming for you every single week. I'll see you next time.